Delicious. Okay. So you... Let's go to here. Actually, you don't even need to. I already have enough wort. Yeah, we'll, we'll successfully occupy this here. Actually, you can unite down here. Unite with these guys. God, I'm not going to have enough research points. That just sucks. That just really, really sucks. Hmm. No, music come, music go, I guess. Uh, okay. You guys need to head on down here. I know there's another army up there, but I'm going to have to deal with them later. Because these guys, ooh, they just got fucking stomped on. Okay. The rest of you, just move up on your own. Don't step on each other, please. That is a bad thing and a no-no. Just say mobilize. Well, not totally mobilize, but we still want to throw a lot of men on. And just shame the Chileans by losing to a bunch of, you know, an African empire that somehow moved a hundred thousand troops over to South America. You know, the huge. Right, they won't accept this offer. Fine, just throw your men in. I don't care anymore. Go ahead. Into the meat grinder. Since we're actually connecting our lands now, we can actually build up armies too, so that's good. That's just fantastic. Oh, looks like Colombia's at war. Probably gonna lose that because it's well Colombia versus Brazil, and I'm sure you know how that's gonna end. How's the culture going? There's still plenty of Platinans, oddly enough. Let's get these guys out now because they're just suffering attrition for nothing. There's a small army we can take care of. Oh no, there you go. And I'm assuming, no, not even 2,000 there. Wow, only about 1,500. Tulker Argentine. That is such a weird area. What the fuck? Wait, no, oh no, we already took that land. I was about to say, like, how do they already have the Africans? We had a full bay, or have turned that area of Argentina now into, you know, full, full bay lands. Our truce ends in two years. We could just keep going back and forth. But I kind of want to attack Peru. We just can't get to them, man. Man, if I had taken over Jujoy, I'd be able to take over uh, that southern area and then just take over all of Bolivia. That would have been perfect. But of course, Brazil had to get in the way because they're assholes. They're a bunch of no good assholes. That's what they are. Ugh. But uh, yeah. Yeah, this is um going pretty swell. Pretty swell indeed. How's the rest of the world? We have Italy over here. Belgium, the Netherlands. I don't know how the hell Spain's been doing so well. Usually they fall apart every five seconds. We got the Suez Canal built by La France. Colombia, still not under anyone. Wow, no one's even going for Colombia. What the hell? Odd. Uh, Qing, they're still a primitive nation. Japan's a great power now. Australia isn't a thing yet. Is Canada a thing? Canada is still not a thing yet. Oddly enough, the United Kingdom has cores in, like, Idaho, but it doesn't have cores up in Canada. Kind of, uh, kind of weird. Kind of weird, you know? Alright, migrations. 114 migrants. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're, these dudes are just moving all over the place. Why are there so many people migrating into here? Shanghai, Fulbe, just this whole the Tulikur Empire is just such a clusterfuck. You have a lot of Mande as well. Hmm. Next, we'll take over. I think Santa Fe. Give us a nice chunk of land. Ooh, Brazil is totally alone now. Oh, it is. It is indeed. Now they do actually have it. A um, an army, but. Kind of the only ones that I can attack. The only ones left I can attack. At least right now. Uh, what happened to the other army? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, you're... Oh, shit. You're just dying up there, aren't you? You need to get out. Um, let's move our armies over here. You know what? Um, oh, you. 
We'll move another army over to South America. None of these clippers are getting made, which just hurts me physically. Let's stop tariffing people. Because everything's going well. Oh my god, just imagine if we westernized. We're not going to, but just imagine if we did. Oh, it'd be so beautiful. Army tax only at, at 12. I mean, that's so massive compared to us. But, you know, hope's still there that maybe, just maybe, we could be able to pull something off. Just, you know, at the last minute. Not looking good, though. You're still 40% away, and that's like three more technologies or three more reforms. And of course, we always have that looming disaster of the giant reactionaries. And uh, let's just make sure all these guys are on Hunt Rebel. We have four armies on Hunt Rebel mode. That should be plenty. I have not been fabricating. I should have been. I'm a, just a big old dum-dum. Cholera! Oh, that's not what I needed. That is... That is not something that I needed. At all. At all. Oh, something... Yep, there you go. Nope, stop! Jesus. One, two... Great. No, oh, there's the Tulakur Reactionaries. In Songhai, I might add. Not Songhai. Uh, Sokoto, I might add. Well, no, Sokoto's not even our capital. Segu is. Oh. Well, thank God I have that one dude over there in Segu. And oddly enough, none of them are rising up in the, um... Western portions is all the east. The east is the only area that is rising up. That's weird. <laughs> I love how you're... We're so polarized. You're reactionary or you're liberal. There is no in-between. There is nothing in between. <laughs> like, Jesus, okay. Alright, Luongo is the thing. Uh, I should build another army. Just because I have so much money, you know? I really do just have so much money. All right, you can move. Let's go to Akure instead. Brazilian Menace. Fantastic. Yeah, they're not getting friendly with anyone. Now, they might be friendly with, like, Italy, but is Italy a threat? No, they have no navy and barely any army. They were just stomped on by the uh, French. Now, we're going to be taking over Rio Grande Sul. They're at war with... Are they mobilized? Oh, shit. Actually, they're mobilized. They have nothing. Okay, great. Rio Grande Sul, which is 43 war score, which is, frankly, just massive. Although, it should be easy to take over because this is a bunch of grasslands and stuff, which is super easy to siege up and to stand on top of. Now, we can also go to war with Argentina at this point. They're cordial with the United States. Ah, oh, they're really close. We gotta take as much as possible now. Save the game again. Now, they have, like, no army. So, that should be easy. Have they still not won that war yet? Wait, what is this over? Oh, they're doing for Panama? What the hell? Why would they go for Panama Freedom? Who cares about Panama? No one. Oh, and there's that. One, two... Oh, that's not gonna be enough. Three. Great. Great, great, just great. Wow. So that's going to give us a bit more time to, uh... I think we're just going to go down the coast all the way up to, um... Uh, Rio. Rio de Janeiro. Oh, you know what? We're actually getting a naval base! Yes, we can heal our men! Our ships, I mean. Oh, are we not building? Uh-oh, we're out of regular clothes. Uh-oh, that's no good. Let's do that. Do that. You're healing? Please tell me you're healing. They are, yes. Vision to Argentina. You know what? Let's just keep two armies down here just in case. And the rest just go up to Rio. This looks like farmland. Why is the supply limit so crap? Weird. Very, very odd. Very odd indeed. Alright, so we wanted Santa Fe. Save the game, because I know America was friendly with them. Not friendly, but uh, cordial. Really close. Let's do this for Santa Fe. 28. That's quite a bit. Quite a bit indeed. Alright, all of you get down there, because I know they're going to mobilize. And might as well crush them now. While we still have the chance. 
All right, Rio, keep going, keep going, and just, just take as much land as it at this point. They have eight now. Don't know where they're spawning all these troops. I, I thought they already mobilized, but whatever. Whatever. Right, a Capinias. Yeah, that'll be plenty of supply, I think. At least for our men. Yeah, you can go up here. Squish that army. They're all mobilized forces anyway, so they don't matter. Oh, and there's the United States. That's why I save, kiddos. Fuck. We can't fight the U.S. The U.S. actually has a navy, doesn't it? Yep, 160. 116, I mean. Well. Thus ends our conquest in Argentina. Yeah, that really sucks. Whatever. Uh, war justification. Oh, we still have it. Oh, no. Well, we're just going to lose it, I guess. You guys can move up. Stay over here. And just keep speed going. Alright. I, I, yeah, I, I'm still doubting that we're going to be able to do this in time. I realize this way too uh way too late foreign trading posts all right but i'm not sure that's going to do much oh they're taking a oh that's weird taking a colony from portugal didn't think spain had it in them it's not anymore all right and rio is ours yay great you want to surrender yet they would accept Fantastic. So we go from 48 to... Ooh! 6,000 points! All for Rio Grande Sul. Okay. Okay. That is a nice increase for us, indeed. And look at all these dudes rushing in. That's insane. Insane in the membrane. They never go to the coast. They always go on the inland. Uh... Why Why do you do this? Anti-imperialism war. Rio Grande Sul acquires Rio Grande Sul. Well, actually, I suppose it doesn't really matter to me. Because, you know, I, I don't care about holding the land. I just need it for uh, re literal research purposes. Okay, I just lost a ton of money for some reason. All right, we're going to send our men over to the coasts over here, because I, I know this is probably where they're going to start landing. That's a problem. Because the U.S., I mean, they probably have a good army, don't they? Yeah, 11 techs. If we could just hold them up, you know, they're going to blockade us. That's what they're going to do. They're just going to blockade us and totally screw us over. Oh, but we need this land because... Yeah, I don't care about the Great Powers getting pissed off. We need this land because that naval base... It's too good, man. It's too good. Oh, yeah. For me, your game says Crusade of Kings 2 for the stream. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh, that's a thing. Uh, I, I, I think I, I just said it to the wrong thing. I tried to send it to Victoria 2. It wouldn't let me, though. Then I tried Crusader Kings 2, and then it did let me. I don't know. Just ignore that. I'll get rid of it next stream. I might do Crusader Kings 2 next stream, who knows. But no one no one actually uh, streams Victoria 2. I checked it, like, there were zero people watching Victoria 2 streams uh, before I started. So really, congratulations, you are the eight people, eight people in the world who are watching a stream of Victoria 2. The only ones. Only people in the world. All right, so there's the US. Let's see if we can actually win this battle. Oh man, we are actually killing quite a few. We killed... I mean, they killed a lot more than us, but... We just killed their... Their army. Oh, wow. Hacker occupation's actually pretty high. Which is scary. Oh, yeah, you know what? We can't. We, we just can't. We won that, but it doesn't matter anymore. We'll lose prestige, that's fine. But Rio Grande Sul is now its own country. Congratulations. And they're in the sphere of the U.S., which sucks, but I got what I wanted. Ching? R really? Okay, yeah, we'll be allies with the Chinese. 
I mean, it won't help, but I mean, at least we can have friends, you know? Hey, we killed one United States Army. So that's a plus. Hmm. Anyways, we need to go to war with Paraguay to annex them once and for all. Once and for all. Hopefully that'll give us a bit more um, technology than usual. Because, well, you know, it's a conquest, not just a state. So that would be swell if that would happen. So we are losing a bit of soldiers down here. Okay, uh, I need, can I get two infantry? I can, actually. Exactly two infantry. Go down here. No clippers, unfortunate. Right, you'll land here. Most of our ships have healed up. That's good. We could land another group down here, but I mean, America's screwed us over. We could go to war with Brazil again for like uh, Santa Catarina. They give us a lot of points. Actually, we could go to war for like Santa Cruz up here, and we can go to war with Bolivia. They're a proletarian dictatorship now. Everyone hates them. We'll just annex them. They have no army. This area is pretty shitty too, so I'm sure no one would care. I wonder if they have all these Africans in their land now. It's gotta be weird. Are they a republic? They're their own little... Yeah, a republic. Wait, what? <gasps> I just realized Rio Grande Sul is a primitive nation! Because I owned the land and they liberated them. Oh, that is weird. Oh, there is a naturally... There is a primitive nation in South America right now. Like, a totally natural... Like, okay, me, obviously, but I'm not primitive. I'm partially westernized. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> that's so wrong in so many ways. Whatever. I'm just going to have to deal with that, I guess. London Conference of 1880. Okay, well, that's probably where we're going to die. There it is. There it is. The age of colonialism. Ladies and gents, this is our death. Probably. Probably our death. Probably. Word reached to clear empire of a great meeting of the colonial powers in Europe, wherein it was decided that African nations would be divided amongst them, as if our people were little more than children's toys discarded and left waiting to be picked up. This has caused a great deal of concern amongst those of our people with the knowledge to understand what this means. For others, it has brought little more than resentment as well as vows to fight for our independence when the day comes. This bodes ill for the Tuklera Empire. Well, it bodes ill for all of Africa. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One. I'll try to fight them. But no promises. That won't give us 10%. I need one of these. Okay, uh... Shit, we are so fucked. Okay, we'll just go down here. And you'll go down there. We'll try to fight the uh, Europeans, but it ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna work at all. Uh, modest Sudan... Congratulations, I'm glad you're a thing, but you're not going to last long. rip a -roni and cheese, ladies and gents. rip a -roni and cheese. Uh, am I under anyone? No, I'm still not. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Although, I'm sure they're now getting the um, new CBs that allow them to just... Western approaches... Austria-Hungary can get grievous insults. Yeah, bullshit. Like, you're gonna do anything. Oh, actually, they do have a navy. A fairly large navy. Argentinian reactionaries. Yeah, looks like they're gonna win. Actually, if their Argentinian reactionaries win, then that means America's no longer gonna be friendly with them. Ooh. Ain't that just interesting. Can you please... Can we please get the administrative reform? Or something? Some other reform? Poor favor. Whatever. Typhoid fever. Stuff breaks. People die. We just got to deal with that. 
Come on. Oh, they actually do have an army. They might be able to kill this. Kill this dude. Come on, if Buenos Aires falls, that's good things for me. It's just good. I kind of need good right now. I am the ninth, technically the ninth most powerful nation on Earth. At least ninth best military and fifth most prestigious. People all around the world must be like, holy crap, this Tukalir Empire. It's terrifying. They're just like, killing us. <laughs> killing the South Americans, man. Not like anyone cared about South America before, but you know. Now I'm sure they do. Look at this. What is up with this spread of culture all over Africa? I guess because I conquered it. Yeah, Full Bay is owning all this. Mm. And then like all of freaking Paraguay is chopped up into pieces. Okay. Oh, no. There it is. Oh, fuck. I didn't want this to happen, though. <gasps> Wait, no. They might actually win. No, they lost. Rip, rip in peace. All right. You know, I'm just going to go to war with Paraguay. We just gotta. We've just gotta do it. Look at that. We're only partially that little bit. One, two, three, four. Four. That little bit is Catholic. That means that's that's the amount of uh, Latin Americans we have. And we're still still majority full bay. We must be converting a lot of people to full bay for some reason. Weird. When does this happen? 11, 4, 3, 6. Okay, it's getting close. Ugh, I hate this. We were so close. There it goes. Annexation on Paraguay. Maybe we'll be able to uh, take more land. Oh, shit. No one's friendly with them, are they? America's getting cordial. Not something I wanted to hear. Actually, don't. You just loop around. Get up to Asuncion. No, you'll get up to Asuncion, and you, you'll just move up. Usually we have to. We have to siege up this land because it's uh, the war goal. The state's the war goal, you know? So, Oh, no! Uh, yes! Paraguay's all alone here! Please tell me no one's influencing... Oh, shit, the United States is influencing them. We need to do this now. We need to get this done. This is the only way. The only way! Oh, and they lose. Great. So, I'll, actually, I should get this first, just in case. Tax efficiency increase, max loan. You know, let's do that. So, we currently have nothing. How much does this give us? 6,000! 6, 6,000 points, all for Paraguay. Thank you, a Paraguay. Paraguay. Para, par, pair of people. Okay. Um... Allied with Panama. Panama is a kingdom? Yep, Panama is a kingdom. Ew. And people are colonizing right now, I think. Liberia's gained land. Yep, France has gained land. The British. The British are being British. Let's just keep building more. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. It won't be enough, but at least we can fight, you know? They'll just blockade us, anyways. So it doesn't matter in the end, I guess. In the end. Okay, so Italy is friendly, but Italy doesn't have any ships, so they can't do anything to attack us. So we'll just invade Brazil and uh, win. When is our truce end? Next year. Good. Dongola concession. There it is. You see the um, demands? They can demand lands. That's what I'm scared of. So I'm, I'm certain the British are going to do. Oh, look at that. Austria. Hungary owns Ethiopia. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's just not good. That's just, frankly, disgusting. Sorry, I was looking at the stream again. I mean, as long as I keep building up my military power. Oh, they've moved their men out because they're taking over Luongo. The British are... looks like they're focusing in other places. Maybe... <gasps> what the fuck? What the fuck? I've never seen the Maritime Union. Whoa. Okay, so what the hell happened with Canada? Canada's just not a thing. But we have the Maritime Union, which... Ew. Mm. Whatever. What a year bar. Okay. 
Who is this? Morocco and Egypt want allies. Egypt? Eh, I'm not going to be your ally. Morocco? Eh, you know what? I am uh, not looking forward to uh, being allies with you guys. I will be honest. Maybe they're just scared that I have such a massive army. I mean, it's it's not like a bad army. We can fight, just not for long. We have, and I guess we've proven ourselves. Like we fought other, we fought civilized nations. So maybe we've proven ourselves, you know? Maybe indeed. And uh, maybe we should actually fund the army more now. Because, I'll be honest, having more brigades wouldn't hurt would not hurt at all. Yeah, I think these clippers are just dead. They're not going to happen. Should have just ignored them for now. You allied with anyone? No. Peru is actually hostile with everyone because they're communists. Ecuador is hostile with everyone. Venezuela is actually in the sphere of Britannia. Is our true end? 9th of September. Okay. Yeah, everyone's rushing for Africa right now, you can tell. Algeria, Egypt, Egypt, Madagascar. Sad. What a sad, sad world we're now living in. Where the European powers can just move into Africa all they want. <laughs> and take what they want. But not the Tulukur Empire. T Tukulur Empire. How are the fuck you pronounce me? West Africa. There you go. They can't take West Africa because we're just too strong, goddammit. Yeah, now they have a lot of ports in the area. I'll, I'll use this one to take over Banjui, but they're building quite a few in Africa. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, no, I'm sorry. Shit. Who's already getting built? Jugu? No, it's the Nugu. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. And there you go. Ah, it's not going to be enough. They have level 15 tech. We have level 2, right? Yep, level 2. That just sucks. That just bites my butt. I will be honest. Yeah, look at that. The Dutch own all the southern Sudan and all of Sudan. And um, that piece of uh, Egypt. Germany owns Alexandria. France owns Sinai. Disgusting. And how decadent of them. Oh, well, Argentina has more rebels, but uh, they have enough army. Right, I can go to war. Still friendly, but that doesn't matter to me. I can make them... Oh man, what if I made them into my vassal? Wouldn't that be weird? Let me do this monthly. Okay. This is going to kill my OCD, because I'm just going to be losing troops over and over again. Actually, I'll go to Asuncion. Can we gain access? No, no, you hate me. Mostly because of uh, Infamy. Man, Infamy sucks. It just sucks balls. Okay, and you know what? You guys can split. You can actually build an army, can't you? Yeah, you actually have an army, and I'm sure with their millions of people, they can actually develop quite an army. I need to sneeze. Give me a second, guys. Okay, hopefully you didn't hear that. Anyways, um, yeah. Screw infamy. And keep going up. I suppose you'll keep going. And how many points do we have? Okay, so we just need 25 points in um in civiliz civilization percentage points, whatever the fuck they're called. Civilization progression? I don't know. But damn, it's gonna be so good if we can westernize. We're so big and so powerful. And then we could just screw over all the uh, Europeans in Africa. We can just invade them, do a uh, dismantle nation. We can just take over all their lands in Africa. Oh, it's going to be beautiful. Just beautiful. I mean, the justification is going swimmingly. We're going to take over, um, what was it? 
Why am I sa saving every month? No, don't do that. We'll take over Santa Cruz. Hopefully that doesn't cost a lot. Now, Italy might join, because they are friendly. I think they're dumb if they do, though. Santa Cruz. Go to Santa Cruz. All of you guys. Just invade. Invade their lands, men. Since supply limit 17.5 yet. Why are you getting attrition? That's weird. Uh, yeah, Paraguay. Not Paraguay. Um... Panama has joined. They are attacking into Durados like right now. They have huge advantages over us. And we barely won that. But we gotta just throw everyone we have at them. Just to make sure we can kill the, the real army. Just leave their tiny um, mobilized force. That'll be just about all they have. And they're all going up here. Let's stop them. And it looks as though um, they're not actually. Italy is not actually joining. It's good for us. You know, at least. Oh, and they mobilize more. They got more mobilization. Oh, that hurts. Oh no. Oh, they mobilize a lot of people there. 21 21 brigades now but we're holding we're holding steady oh now there you go and it all fell apart okay let's reload the save let's rethink our strategies here rethink the old the, the old strategies Personally, I think we're screwed. <laughs> That's the strategy. We're just screwed and we're going to have to deal with it. Yeah, and that's the entire army destroyed. Oh, God. Did I not save? I didn't save. Let's reload the save from before. Oh, that sucks. That just really sucks. I'm losing a lot of men. It has, that has to be from attrition. It has to be, because we're not actually losing men. Oh, hey, how's the culture? Mossy, full bay. Just imagine these African tribes popping up in South America. Like, okay. And also, just, it's Muslim, too. <laughs> They're all Muslims. Or animists. Either one. Okay, and it's Santa Cruz. Proceed. You know what? We're gonna just, just get another army over here. Why not? Why not Zoidberg? Haha, <laughs> what a meme. Oh, and you fucked up. Fucked up real bad. Just run. Just run. And I lost the entire navy there. Not the entire navy, but eight. Not eight, two. I only have eight left. Is he seriously still attacking in there? Wow, he's not smart. I mean, he's still damaging the crap out of us, but like... You know. Alright, so currently he has 16. That's still a good amount. But, uh, yeah, they're attacking into us. That is a completely mobilized force we can attack into. Oh, but they're gonna attack into us? No. No, I don't believe so. We'll get there first. Are they st wow, they're still attacking us. I mean, they're taking a huge chunk out of our men. Oh my god. Oh my god. We've lost too many. We can't do this. Yeah, we can't. It's just too many men. <sighs> well, that just sucks. Hmm. Alright, Rio Grande Sul. Oh no, they're still in. That's weird. Why are they only friendly now? Maybe I should just move more men over. 
I'm still surprised they haven't declared war on me or anything. Yeah, they're not even around. Only 30,000 are around. You know what? Um, this is actually probably where I'm just going to end this stream. Um, I got to think more about this. My strategy before I go on and continue. Definitely going to continue on, though. Oh, look at that. Socialists. <laughs> That's weird. Socialists in an uncivilized nation. Uh, I'm going to continue on, though. Definitely. Definitely. Uh, we've taken a good chunk out of... Um, South America here, and hopefully if we can take over Santa Cruz, we can t continue on to Bolivia and then Peru, and by then we'll probably be a civilized nation, and we'll just own a ton of South America. We can release nations, probably. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Ilya too, and I'll see you guys in uh, the next stream. Uh, goodbye. Uh...